those photos. Not this one, those one. This is not phosphorus. Israel didn't use phosphorus in Gaza, period. If we use thousands of phosphorus shells in Gaza, where are those people? I've never seen one photo of a guy with a uh, deformation. We didn't use phosphorus. Palestine is the story of genocide. So why are you guys here today? Why are we here today? Because we're protesting the war criminal that's inside. The war criminals inside? Uh-huh. We're in solidarity with the people of Palestine against a brutal, oppressive terrorist regime known as the State of Israel. Essentially a fascist state like the United States bent on the uh, genocide of Palestinian Arabs. And as a veteran of the U.S. military and part of the occupation of Iraq, I saw firsthand like the inhumanity and just like the gross, egregious nature of imperialism and fascism. And uh, I'm just here in solidarity with the people of Palestine and against these bastards. I'm here to support Palestine and I'm pro-Jewish but anti-Zionism. Judaism is a religion and Zionism is an idea that they can kill all the people who they don't like and they push them out of the land. So you're against stealing other people's land? Yes. And that's what the Zionism is about? Yes, they push out the Palestinians and force them to leave. That's not fair. I know, but it's happening. And it needs to be stopped. If you had something to say to Mr. Gruber, what would it be? He's inside finishing up his talk while I was standing out here. Colonel Ben Zion Gruber, sir, you cannot call war crimes ethical. And that's what I have to say to you. Even if they try to limit collateral damage as much as possible? Even if. Stop the war crimes. Murder right. is not justified. He gave us a thumbs up. What do you think about this war criminal Gruber? Well, it's total bullshit what he has to say. And this is a trademark of Israeli policy. They always try to whitewash their war crimes. They're committing war crimes every day. They're committing ethnic cleansing. They're committing genocide. And they try to pretend that it's self-defense, that they're the ethical, moral army in the world. And it's all pure propaganda. And we're here to stand against it and to let them know that we're watching them, that there are people against this, that we won't be quiet, that we'll face them. And they are losing the PR war. We're gonna be here every time an Israeli war criminal comes to town, we will be here and stand against them. Palestine is the story of genocide. Ripped out by the roots and scattered like ashes Erased and replaced by white settler fascists Disgrace labeled terrorist or was it savage? Palestine is the story of genocide Indigenous existence, autonomous persistence As the distant sun glistens, we are rising No more compromising with genocide No more tolerating occupation Refugees will be returning, reparations will be churning As the bourgeoisie is burning We are the story of resistance We are the story of resistance so listen, this is Prince's kiss, wake up and raise your fist, resist happily ever after.